I didn't know I was looking for you I didn't know there was something to find Tomorrow you won't fit in yesterday's shoes And I'm trying so hard to rewind Hey guys, so just a quick one to say my son is here on Earth. Uh, finally, he's being born and he is happy and healthy and strong. And he's very inquisitive and very alert for such a, a small and young being. He's only two days old now. And his name is Aslan Arthur Shikoba St. Julian. He took my surname and not Fritzy's. And I'll do a video about his name another time. Uh, but it's kind of a compilation of things we wanted so all is well fritzy is still in hospital unfortunately aslan got very uncomfortable during labor and his heart uh, rate slowed down and this meant that the doctors insisted on surgery but for all we'd hoped for a completely natural birth uh, we wanted to do what was safest and that was what was safest for aslan and for mum and that leads me on to the fact that we were here in Germany to do it. Now, this is a tricky topic for me because I felt guilt over it because I can leave Tanzania and come here and have a safe hospital, safer hospital for my son to be born in. And the whole idea of us needing money for that, which God has provided uh, using our Patreon supporters made me very guilty because my friends and my children in Tanzania have to make do with their medical facilities. And it's quite high, I believe. One, I, I, I might be wrong, I think it's one in three uh, childbirths in Tanzania end in fatality. So, and plus we've got all the disabled children where accidents happened in the hospital, etc. So giving birth there was frightening of course Fritzi should be near her family as well at this time but I felt a great deal of guilt over having the money to leave but uh, I also know that if my friends and, f and family over there had the ability and the visa to leave and the money to leave they would probably do the same as well so if it weren't for us having that ability then uh, things, the childbirth is very different in Africa. It's a different thing altogether. And the fact there were complications and Fritzi needed the surgery and we were in a good hospital in Germany. I was just grateful at that moment. I was thinking, wow, you know, if I was in Tanzania, this could be so different. And I was just so grateful for everyone who's a Patreon, uh, a patron on Patreon. And I just wanted to re-emphasize that and say thank you. Uh, that my son is safe in this world and I didn't have money to even fly us here without uh, you guys who send us money on PayPal me and Patreon as well. Uh, somebody actually, uh, Audrey, it's a very wonderful lady, uh, when I was sick sent me a thousand dollars on uh, privately and because because I've been sick and paid all this money for these tests and everything, which had to be private, and then I had all these extra flights that we didn't expect, me flying to England and Fritzy and then Fritzy coming here and me flying back and coming back was all just very frightening as a provider for your family. It's frightening providing for a family of 105 at times, but it was just very frightening because the costs here are so much so different you know it's so expensive and it, it in comparison to uh you know i can <clears throat> feed all 105 of our children for around about 1500 dollars for seven days to give you an eye around about there sometimes it fluctuates depending if anyone's sick etc but I can also only fly back here for that same amount so it doesn't seem balanced is what I mean in my mind and, and a lot of guilt rises in me but I safest place was for to be here and uh, I, I actually thought about you all for all I don't know you all I just my mind rushed with it in the hospital I was just so grateful for all of you and I was quite overwhelmed just thinking about that the fact that all of these people I'm, I, I've never met many of you most of you I've never met uh, you're the reason I can do we, you're the reason we can function, you know, whilst we're looking after all those other children as well. You're the reason that we were able to be here um, and the reason that Fritzi got the best care that she could. So thank you. Uh, you played a role in my son's arrival and he's a very beautiful little boy. 
and I'm eternally grateful for all support, love and prayers. So it was just a little one to see here, videos might be a bit all over uh, and I'm going to make one more video now to tell you the unbelievable events that led up to his birth because I think it's quite an interesting little story and also it tells you the value of uh, meditation because I had to go through something that I don't wish any person should endure with regards to pain the day before he arrived. So I'll do that video now anyway. But for now, uh, my boy is, has arrived safe and well. He's very beautiful, very happy, very alert. And uh, I'm going to the hospital now to see them. Unfortunately, uh, we still haven't worked out in the West how the system should be. There's family rooms, but they're all full, so I'm not allowed to stay at night, which kills me, to be honest. feels very unnatural. But we'll get there eventually as a society. For now, I shan't complain about the only problem I've seen with the medical care here is that I can't stay with my son at night. So, I love you all. Thank you. And yeah, join me in welcoming my little Aslan, or my little Shakoba, as I keep calling him more often. Uh, to us. Bye guys. I didn't know I was looking for you I didn't know there was something to find Tomorrow you won't fit in yesterday's shoes And I'm trying so hard to rewind You came to me as an empty cup I didn't know love could ever be real And every day I tried to fill you up with everything that I thought you would feel Through the years, the sorrow, the joy that we borrow The tears that we share with the rain Oh, today, tomorrow, forever I'll follow your trail Just call my name Took your first step into a world that was wide as the sky I held your belly there against my chest I was there when you needed to cry I never knew a friend could be so small And have a heart just as big as the moon You know I can't stop you from growing up I just wish that it wasn't so soon Through the years The sorrow The joy that we borrow The tears that we share with the rain Oh, today, tomorrow Forever I'll follow your trail 